لبيك اللهم لبيك لبيك لا شريك لك لبيك إن الحمد والنعمة لك والملك لا شريك لك Okay, guys, that's our plate right now. This is our forks. Our forks. This is your food. Ooh! <laughs> when you're in Saudi. Oh my gosh, this is so much fun. Oh. Let me try a little. Ooh. Oh, this goes on the plate too. <laughs> Hi, guys. So, if I haven't told you, we're in uh, Saudi. Uh, for Hajj and uh, we're in Medina currently to you know do Ziyara and uh, we're currently by the Mount Uhud and where the Prophet's uncle's grave is uh, if you know the story this was where the Battle of Uhud was fought and on those mountains uh, the Prophet's uncle was uh, killed so he's buried right here um, I'm not really going to vlog during Hajj, but snippets, when I can, I will. I just thought this was, you know, uh, an interesting story in Islam, so I wanted to share with you. Now it's there, and that's the mountain, so people go on there. Uh, yeah, I shouldn't be showing you the graves though. So we come here to pray for the deceased, have a look around, and they have a little, uh, you know, like a market where people can buy stuff. Yep. I just wanted to show you. So these are Ajwa dates, and uh, they were planted by the Prophet, sallallahu alaihi wasallam. One thousand four hundred years. Ago. More than one thousand four hundred years ago, and they're still growing till today. Um, so yeah, just so you know, when you come here, it's good to buy. Yep. This one that is currently on the mountain. I've never climbed the mountain. Look at it. Was where the battle was fought. Guys, Sister, don't do anything without this. Exactly. Oh my god. It's like, so good. It. That's an essential, guys. Yeah. But thank God it's not even sunny, but still, it's, it's still hot. really hot. Without but this, this spray, view, it's just like heat. It is, man. Yeah. Wow, it is actually. Sunset. Still going up. Uh, so guys, we are, oh, focus on me, Masjid al -Iblatain. Uh We came here to pray to Raka'as. So this was where the Prophet got the revelation to change uh, Qibla from Masjid Al-Aqsa to Mecca. So in this mosque right here, there are two Qiblas. <laughs> Hi guys, good morning. We are on our way from Medina to Mecca and it's going to take seven hours to go because we're driving. And this is my ihram. We have to, you know, take a special bath, wear it, and be ready. We are on our way to Mecca. <laughs> we have all the snacks in the world. Because wow. guess what, it's going to be like an almost a 10 hour drive maybe, maybe 7. And of course as we're, you know, on this journey, we're reciting the big It's like answering God's um, call, you know. Yeah. <laughs> So guys, we just stopped somewhere, I don't know where, to pray Maghrib and Isha and the toilets. Don't even think about using it. Oh, you better just have your crocs ready. <laughs> There's water everywhere, just prepare. This journey is where you're gonna need your crocs or your slippers. Don't come with your, uh, you know sneakers or anything that's not for here you need your slippers or your crocs yeah on the way to Mecca never mind there might be shops that you can buy flip-flops <laughs> okay guys this is my corner and yeah 
can see my Facebook, you can see my money, my badge. Bathroom. And then, what to expect? Guys, oh my god. I don't think you can see it, but we have a war gecko. It's gonna fall on us and it's gonna kill us. It's. <laughs> oh, it's moving. <gasps> Apparently, there's a baby one inside there. Let me show you. It's not inside. Let me show you. The one. Where is it? Camouflage, yeah? Camouflage. Hello, baby. Can you see it? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Guys, well, I look like this because it is what it is. It's so hot, but that AC is so good. Still in Arafat, and um, we are exhausted and sleepy. I'm about to get up now and go outside, perform ablution, inshallah, and come and pray. We came here specifically to pray. It's real, it's real, guys. Everyone's passed out. I'd show you, but I can't show you. So. It's over guys, Arafat is over and we're walking to the bus, it has to be a low angle because I don't want to get people's faces, but yeah, <laughs> Alhamdulillah we got to pray, I did not vlog obviously while being in there because you know, in fact I forgot about vlogging to be honest. Salifa, we're here to pick up pebbles to stone the devil, to stone the Jumarat. Um, we're spending the night here. It's now like 1 a.m. And yeah, I am on the mountain. That right there is the mountain we just climbed. Collected our pebbles. We need uh, like 49, I think. Our coach driver has a kitchen. It's making tea. So the bus, so the fact that it's a bus. I know, right? <laughs> it just looks like a kitchen thingy. Look at him. Oh. Wow. Okay, I want a cup too. Is it good? Yeah, that's what we're looking for. She got her cup. Lit. <laughs> it's lit. It's lit. We are going to stone, guys. Did you know how That's one of the pillars that we're going to stone at. Oh, <laughs> 
guys we're back and i just want to let you guys know that by now after the stoning the jamarat after stoning the devil you're gonna stink <laughs> we stink i stink i stink like actual crap <laughs> what do you smell what do you smell like curry time with maggie <laughs> Oh, by the way guys it hasn't ended no it hasn't we're just taking a break we're at the hotel right now we have to go and pay for our sacrifice and then go to do umrah it's after umrah after we cut our hair that's when hajj is over and ihram's off and we're officially hajjis and hajjis so right now <laughs> we're just gonna eat and then go out again for Umrah and you know exhausted but yeah guys um, I showed you a little bit of history in Medina and right now we're here doing Ziara in Mecca um, we're at a museum oh, no. can I just say that I so much appreciate the architecture anyway so wah! guys I'm a bit challenged okay I had a procedure done in this arm so I can't bend it I'm gonna be looking. Oh my god. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> the wind. Right, guys, this right here is used to be the well of Zamzam. my favorite part of all up there on that mountain I'll try and zoom in was where um, the first ayahs of the Quran was revealed to the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam Ikra halak right there people are going up but it's so far up we will not be able to I don't know if you can see them but it's that mountain right there that's where the cave is oh guys so um it's 5 30 a.m and i'm about to go and do my farewell dua from talking like this because my sister's sleeping in the other room but um yeah so it's time to wrap this up and go home so today we're going to Jeddah. from Jeddah we're going to istanbul from istanbul we're going to abuja inshallah <laughs> 